Well, I went off to the junk store today. Um, a little bit because I wanted something, a little bit because I was bored. <laughs> so this is what I came up with. Uh, $2.10 worth of goodies. So I got three of these and a couple of these. So uh, I wanted some more high value oscillators. So this is an 80 megahertz. Uh, so maybe I'll make one of those. And this is 160, 162.4 megahertz. So that's interesting. That's nice and high. Um, and then these guys are uh, IF filters. So they're three legs, they're not crystals, they're IF filters, and they're 70 megahertz. So I don't know what kind of specs they have, but they were only 50 cents, so I got three of those just for fun. And uh, maybe they uh, will be a good addition to my collection as well. So I think the first thing to do is see if the 70 megahertz uh, is narrow or broad. All right, there we go. I uh, got the little crystal hooked up and uh, the filter, whatever it is, <laughs> and that's what we got. It's centered on um, 70 megahertz, so it's, uh, let's see, this is a 500 kilohertz span. Let's go to a 100 kilohertz span. Yeah, there we go. So it goes up. It's a little double hump. So I don't know if that means two pole, I guess. And it's got a couple extra bumps out there. Uh, I know my viewers are going to say, well, that's because you have to match it. Well, I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I guess I should read up on these things. Uh, we'll go back to a megahertz sweep. You can see it pops. And then there's a couple little, couple little bumps out there. 200 kilohertz. Yeah. A little extra, little extra bump there and get my hand near it. Look at that. Wow. So... I don't know what it'll do when I put it inside a can. Uh, we'll, see, we'll see. I like it though. I think it'll be, it'd be a good addition. Okay, so how do we do? So here's the uh, 70 megahertz uh, oscillator and we can see all of the uh, harmonics. So I will, I will remove that and I will put in its place the uh, filter that we just built. So that will go that will go in there like that. And then we will look at the output. And we'll look at that. Perfectly clean. So we've killed all the harmonics. We've just left the uh, 70, uh, 70 megahertz. So great filter.